Greenpeace did a study uh, in 2018 um, across the world uh, on microplastics presence in different salt brands. And it found out that uh, there were significant amounts of microplastics um, in the sea salt, in the lake salt, even in the rock salt. So microplastics are in our food, they are in our air, they are in our water, and they are causing health problems. So we started by collecting plastic waste and reselling to recyclers. That was in 2017. Then we realized um, six months down the line, three to six months down the line, that we were collecting more than we could resell, than the recyclers could uptake. So it was that we, we decided what more can we do with the remaining plastic to just improve on the, on the, on the to do like a value add aspect so that we can see if we can bring a product to the market using the plastic waste. And hence, we started making the pavers. In Nairobi alone, we generate about 500 metric tons of plastic waste every single day. And only a fraction of this is recycled. The rest finds its way into the environment and up to the dump site. It is that we saw an opportunity because waste in itself is a resource. Once the manufacturers uh, package the soft drinks or whatever product they are packaging, once the consumer finishes with that um, product, they have nowhere else to take it other than the litter box. And the, the garbage collectors, the, the, least, the best they can do is sort it on the level they can and recycle that which they can recycle, that which they can't, they take it to the dump site. And so with that we decided, why don't we create like a plug where instead of having that plastic to go uh, to the dam site, we like intercept it on the way and hence started the making business. We had used the ballast before, uh, but most of the trainees were complaining the ballast was uh, damaging their shoes. So the Jijenge pavers, we find them very friendly. Uh, walking on them feels like you're walking on rubber, because I, I understand they are made of, they also ha have some plastic in them. They're environmentally friendly. They're also beautiful because you get different colors and uh, they are easy to clean, especially when you are, uh, the cleaners are sweeping them and they have really transformed our institution.
there are no studies to show um, to what extent uh, microplastics can affect human health, but scientists fear that this, it could be much worse than we think. So the solution is uh, we need to stop uh, producing pla single-use plastics, especially uh, at the source, for us to be able to address this issue. Because recycling has not worked globally, has not worked here in Kenya, and is not going to work because uh, it is a false solution and uh, we do not have uh, proper infrastructure, especially here in Kenya, to uh, uh, be able to effectively recycle ourselves out of the plastic pollution.